Kanye West is setting the record straight on his disorder. Well, I mean, previously Kanye was telling us that he was bipolar and now Kanye is saying that he has signs of autism. So Kanye is saying that this was linked back to his car accident in 2002, where Kanye was driving home from a recording studio around 3 a.m. and he fell asleep behind the wheel of a Lexus, crashing into an oncoming car and Kanye completely shattered his jaw on the accident. And that's when Through the Wire came out, if you guys remember that song. So this autism information came out from a text from Kanye to Elon Musk, where Kanye says, when are we going to speak? You owe me nothing. You never have to speak to me again. But if we do speak, the nature of the relationship has to change. I'm not bipolar. I have signs of autism from my car accident. He also states, you can't watch Kim keep my kids from me and not say anything publicly. Then call yourself my friend so I can bring my audience to your struggling platform. So you're probably wondering how these texts got out to the public. And uh, it was through a third party. And that third party being Ian Kanye. Honor, a fashion figure that's been around Kanye's circle for years. Kanye instructed Ian himself to get the message out because Kanye has been banned from all these big social media platforms. Kanye texting Ian saying, get this out to the public. Ian Connor saying, say less, 2.22 AM. So all my love for Kanye's music aside, I couldn't imagine dealing with all the ups and downs of being Kanye's friend. I mean, when people say harsh things to you, those messages get etched into your head forever. Telling Elon Musk that his Twitter platform is struggling and then asking why he didn't defend you. I mean, maybe Elon's glad now that he didn't defend you because now he knows the real you. I don't care what anyone says. That is a bizarre way to confront somebody. And I am not saying Kanye is a bad father, but the reality of things is Kanye is so wishy-washy as a person emotionally. Just put yourself in Kim's shoes for two seconds. Forget that it's Kanye. Forget that it's your favorite musician. Would you want a sporadic man? like this being around your kids I don't know I, I don't think I would the autistic thing potentially a bipolar thing it's sad and it does give them a slight edge but you're still in control of how you treat others okay let's not forget that but that's pretty much it guys I'll see you in the next one